15 years since the second National Treasure film. Can you talk a little bit about how the National Treasure series was updated or modernized for this show? Um, for example, highlighting topical issues such as immigration with the character of Jess. Yeah, I mean, I mean, um, I think one thing I love so much about our show, uh, especially for a modern audience, is we shine light on um, on uh, indigenous culture and the histories of people that deserve the platform. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? That really deserve to have their story told. And uh, especially through Jess, I mean, she's connected to to such a giant Pan-American treasure and she's yes. such a strong, well-written character. Um and, and and I think audiences are, are going to going to pick up on that. It's it's been really exciting, kind of deep diving into this uh, new new treasure, new culture, new history. And I think it's the perfect time and the uh, the perfect platform for a modern audience as well. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I learned a lot about um, you know dreamers. I, I didn't really know what that was. Um, you know, being from Australia and um, um, oh, uh, what's it? What's the other thing? Jess says she's a. Uh, uh, um, no. Yeah. Uh, oh, right? Daka. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. She's Daka. Daka. Yeah. Oh, wow. Mm. But, <laughs> so uh, you know, Lisette uh, introduced me to some documentaries on that. So there is a lot of history as well, but there's also a lot of current issues that like um, that I'm being educated about too. So I hope the audience can um, learn about those things if they're not already educated on those things which like really quick sidebar should say like uh this character means so much to Lisette and and mm -hmm. just the yeah. research and what she did and how close it is to her yeah I mean it was not lost on our on us not only was she's an amazing leader in the show she just like she was always so willing to fill us in and uh I mean yeah just you know she really took this role to heart and I think it shows in the show I just had to say that yeah, like, yeah. 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 it's true it was, and also the aspect that we were talking earlier about how when you're watching the original movies, you learn a lot about American history, right? But mm -hmm. and now this younger generation is going to be able to learn about the, yes. this new, yeah, you yeah. know, and and it's very very cool that this younger generation is get, like has this vast and and this uh, I don't know, no, the, right. I, yeah, like yeah. it's 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 very very exciting that that we're going to be able to introduce a lot of people including myself i didn't know a lot about malinche or any of this this same as well same yeah. yeah so it's it's very it was very interesting for me myself to learn as well so i love that i love that um so i have to ask what was it like working with the one and only Catherine zeta jones is there something people be surprised to know about her i heard there was some singing on set i heard that earlier oh yeah she's in broadway she's broadway yeah yeah it's Catherine, and she's, she's really Catherine. funny she's i mean it's not that you wouldn't funny. expect her to that'd be funny but I mean, she's just like she's really witty and has got like a super funny sense mm -hmm. of humor uh yeah, yeah. yeah and you know she she plays such a such an intimidating character but she really is such a sweet human and yeah. you know she does kidnap me in the show but is was the sweetest throughout the entire time so also kidnaps your heart yeah kidnap i love that I love that that's like sounds like a song lyric for, for your character kidnapping the heart <laughs> I had to throw that in there. Um, so last question. Um, there are a few returning actors from the first two films, including Harvey, Armando, and of course, Justin. Um, did you guys learn anything, um, get any advice from them about the national treasure world? Uh, yeah, I mean, the first day that Justin was on set, we got rained out for four hours and we all had to sit in the same van together for for, for about three or four hours. And we just got actually Armando was in there too, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, and we just got all of these like <laughs> stories about life on set and talking with with Justin about the first table read of the first movies and everything. Like it was, it was there was like tr treasure in that in yeah, that conversation. No truly. pun intended. Yeah, no, it was it was like the best. It really was.